Hi, good morning. I'm Guinea Anesia. I'm here with your oracle card reading for February regarding your health, your career, and your relationships. I'm going to be using the Nature's Whispers uh, cards, oracle cards. And uh, let me remind you that if you need a personal reading, you can always go on to my website, guineaneja.com. That is G-I-N-N-I-A-N-E-J-A.com. I'm also available, uh, available on Facebook and LinkedIn, so you can message me there. And on Instagram, uh, if you haven't already liked or followed uh, my Instagram page, it's guineaneja11. And um, my number is 810-887-2131. For international subscribers, you have to add the code plus 91 to that number. You can call me on WhatsApp and you can also message me now uh, when it comes to february 2019 the first card for health is catch your breath and as we see there is a child hugging a tree now uh, when i do the numerology uh, uh, reading for february you will understand exactly why we get these kinds of cards and why they say what they do um when i see a child in a card it basically for me signifies the inner child of the person uh, the trauma or the pain or the hurt that the person as a child may have gone through so it becomes very important to forgive and forget and ask for forgiveness it is not necessary that these things happen only when you're a child we all have a child within so even as an adult um, any time in life when something happens it triggers uh, something that may similar that may have hurt us or uh, as a child or angered us so uh, it's it's all connected to the inner child within so um, um, uh, you need to rest you need to regroup you need to reconsider and um, you need to uh, be very uh, practical and logical while making your decisions. Uh, as far as health is concerned, since this card is for health, I would say that you need a lot of rest and relaxation. You also need a lot of mental peace. I'll tell you why, because the next card for relationships is vulnerability. So we all are vulnerable within. It's just that some of us hide it. Some of us are not uh, comfortable expressing our emotions. Uh, also, uh, in this card, if you see uh, the child or the angel as a butterfly is resting, it means give your relationships a rest. It means uh, use some of your space to um, uh, rejuvenate yourself to reconsider a lot of things in your life regarding relationships and um, you probably need to meditate and you probably need to not not probably in fact you definitely need to connect with nature why is because the next card is heighten your vitality by grounding yourself now if you see this person is holding mother earth or a globe or a crystal globe in her hand and there's a lot of activity happening around uh, she seems to be looking into the globe and there are a lot of colors all these colors are the colors of our seven chakras and we need to balance those chakras and uh, because Everything is connected to each other. Health is connected to relationships. Relationships are connected to career. Career is connected right back to health and relationships because they're all a very integral part of our life. So the, this card, Heighten Your Vitality, says um, all these cards are saying that you need to rest, you need to relax, and you need to ground yourself and regain your vitality your energy it's not only physical vitality or energy it is also mental and emotional because again those three aspects of a human are connected to each other if you are mentally tired or emotionally tired you would feel drained and if you are physically tired 
you may be as much uh, enthusiastic mentally or emotionally, but if you're physically tired, it's not going to help. So uh, the theme, it seems, of this month is that you need to rest. Maybe take a vacation because uh, the card here, vulnerability, does say that. That you need to take a short break, take a vacation if you have to, or maybe with your loved ones, take a small weekend off. Uh, so that you can reconnect with them. Maybe there are certain uh, misunderstandings or issues that have cropped up and you need to sort them out. So like mature, intelligent human beings, instead of uh, going the negative way, having guilt, regret, anger, hatred, all these negative emotions only drain us further. Sit down, talk about it, express yourself with love and compassion, try and put yourself in the other person's shoes, and um, uh, rejuvenate yourself for the coming month uh, because March is going to have a lot or going to need a lot of your energy. So see you in the next video. Meanwhile, take care. Goodbye.